Hi guys, in this video we are going to learn how to write sudo code and algorithm to swap two variables without using third variable. Here we have to swap two variables without using third variable. Okay. First we are going to write sudo code. Sudo code is a detailed description of solved problem. It is in the form of user readable form. It is written in natural language like English. Okay. See here, here we have to swap two variables without using third variable first uh, we have to input two variables got it to swap two variable first we have to input two variables consider that is variable a and b here variable a and b are two variables next we have to calculate sum of a plus b that is used to store in variable a here we have to use only two variables that is a and b right so here we have to add two variables a plus b and that value is stored in variable a that is a plus b next we have to find b b value that is here a minus b value consider here a value is 7 and b value is 3 next we have to find sum of a and b that is used to store in variable a right that is 7 plus 3 that is 10 that is 10 next we have to find b value that is a minus b that is 10 minus 3 so b, b value becomes 7 got it here b value becomes 7 instead of 3 here we stored b value is equal to 7 next find a that is formula is same a minus p a minus p that is cr a is equal to a minus p what is the value of a that is 10 right next what is the value of b here now its b value is 7 right so here 7 10 minus 7 is 3 got it so here new a value is 3 next b value is 7 right it is swap value here instead of a is equal to 7 it is replaced swapped with the a is equal to 3 here b value is equal initially it b value is equal to 3 it become b is equal to 7 so this is the swapping value right next we have to print new a and b value that is print a comma b here we are going to print a is equal to 3 and b is equal to 7. Initially it was a is equal to 7, b is equal to 3. Got it? So guys this is the pseudo code to swap two variables without using third variable. Initially we have to input two variable that is input a and b. Next we have to calculate a is equal to a plus b. Next we have to find b value that is b is equal to a minus b. Next, we have to find a value that is a is equal to a minus b. Next, we have to print a and b value. Next, we have to write algorithm. Algorithm is a step by step process to solve a problem. Step 1. It is Algorithm is always start with start statement. So, we have to write start statement. In step 2 in step 2 we have to read two variables right here we have to swap two variables right so here we have to read two variable that is consider a and b step 3 next we have to find a value that is a is equal to a plus b here a is going to store sum of a plus b value next step 4 we have to find b value that is using formula a minus b that is a minus b here we using same method okay step 5 we have to find a value using a minus b method step 6 finally we have to print a and b value here a and b 
is stored new value okay new swapped value initially it is a and b next finally it will give output a value is going to store the b value next here b value is going to store the value of a value that is called as a swapping step 7 in step 7 we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement so guys this is the algorithm to swap two variables without using third variable step 1 is start with start statement step 2 we have to read two variables that is read a and b in step 3 we have to calculate a is equal to a plus b value in step 4 we have to find b that is using formula a minus b in step 5 we have to find a value that is using formula a minus b in step 6 we have to print two variables that is a and b newly stored values it print newly stored value that is a and b in step 7 we have to stop the algorithm using stop statement so guys this is the pseudocode and algorithm to swap two variables without using third variable